is good John welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions it's your boy J.I. and I'm back at it again with another banger for you guys now as you guys see by the title and the thumbnail we have the first mod you know what I'm saying and some of y'all ain't gonna say it's a mod but it changes the appearance of the car it changes something on the car from stock and it takes it to something that's modified so to me it is a modification you did what I'm saying but without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into this video. Let's get it. I don't think my brother Versatile is going to mind if we use his car as a stand. Don't say nothing though. We got the package right here. As you guys can see, it's something small. So it's definitely going to be, um, you know, something small for the car. Got a little roll. And you guys can probably already guess what it is by now. But if not, you know what I'm saying? Yes, yeah, sir. So when you peel back the tape, you got a little installation guide. You know what I'm saying? I know it's hella white balance. The white balance is hella exposed right now, so y'all can't see. And then you got these moves. So this is what it is right here. I'll show you guys where it goes. Y'all probably looking at me like, what the hell is that, J.I.? So basically, as you guys can see on my headlight, we have this disgusting, ugly amber piece right here on the headlight. Don't get me wrong, the headlights are hella clean. I really like the headlights on this car. It's just that amber piece right there. Like, I'm not rocking with this. It doesn't light up. It doesn't do anything. It's literally a reflector. So, what we're going to be doing today is using that black tint. We're going to be blacking out the headlights. Um, and that definitely should make the look of the car in the front end look a lot better. I'm hoping that it changes it. Um, a lot I know it's just a minor thing so it's probably not gonna be like a big difference to you guys but to me as the owner of the car I'm definitely gonna be able to tell whenever I walk up to the car and look at it and plus that's just a big eyesore alright y'all so as you can see the Sun is shining down on this spot right here like it's crazy but over here there's a little bit of shade so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take the stain from right there and put it just a little bit more shade so your boy doesn't sweat buckets uh too crazy like you guys have seen me been doing in this Houston heat man now let's get straight into this video so the first step is you're going to want to clean the surface that you're working on so we're going to grab some waterless wash and go ahead and wipe down the headlights completely make sure they're clean and then we can go ahead and lay over the tent this is not sponsored at all but chemical guys if y'all want to sponsor your boy Go ahead, hit me up on Instagram at J.I. Productions underscore. Tap in with the key. Spray it down. Spray it down the whole head right. Wipe it down. Now, I'm only going to be using this headlight right now, like cleaning this headlight right now, because I want to show you guys a before and after, like, difference comparison of what it looks like with it and without it. So I'm just gonna put this one on first and then I'll show you guys the stock versus the tinted look. All right, you guys, now that you have cleaned the surface, you're gonna wanna use some soap and water and just spray down the headlight because as you are putting the film on there, you wanna be able to move it around and make sure that it's in the right place and then you'll use a squeegee to get all the water and bubbles out. All right, so. Now that you have already sprayed it, you know what I'm saying, you're going to grab the tent, peel it off. So that's just, you know, having it laid on there. It's not squeegeed or anything. And it definitely makes a difference. Just showing you guys real quick, man. It definitely makes a difference. Now, I'm going to go ahead and let it sit for a little bit so that it can adhere. Not like a couple minutes or nothing. Just letting it sit while I talk to y'all. And then I'm going to grab a card and a towel and just squeegee the bubbles out real quick and we should be good to All go. Alright you guys, so as you can see, stock. Tinted. Now doesn't that look better <laughs> than that? You know what I'm saying? I definitely think it makes a big difference. I'm going to go ahead and knock out this side real quick and then I'll give you guys 
quick little B-roll. Nothing crazy because the car is dirty right now. But you know I got y'all. So there you guys have it, you dig what I'm saying? The uh, amber side marker delete, I guess, is what I'm gonna go ahead and call this. It's completely done on the Stang. I'm not even gonna lie, man. It looks 10 times better in my personal opinion. Getting rid of that tacky old amber side marker and just, you know, going clean, sleek with the full blackout. You know what I'm saying? I definitely have thought about completely blacking out the stain and going for that menacing look but i'm not 100 percent sure yet y'all let me know down in the comment section down below also help your boy name this joint drop a comment in the comment section let me know what you guys think i should name it the winner is going to be getting cash yeah, that's right i'm doing a cash giveaway to whoever has the best name in the comment section down below if i choose your name and i choose to you know what i'm saying name the stain after the name that you guys um recommended or you know told me about then you definitely will be getting some bread coming your way via cash app zell uh venmo well not cash app i don't have cash app but zell venmo or just cold hard cash if you're in the houston area and i think that'll be dope because you know what i'm saying not only are you going to be able to get the money you'll be able to meet me in person and see the car in person and maybe even go for a ride along but with all that being said, man, y'all make sure you guys are staying tuned, you have your post notifications on, and you are not missing any vlogs or skipping any of those ads, man. But like I say, that's gonna do it for this video. Just a quick upload, quick little install, quick mod, but makes a very big difference in my personal opinion. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you smash that subscribe button, make sure you turn on those post notifications, and drop a comment in the comment section down below. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>